Today's video is likely to both fascinate and baffle you. Although we like to think we're advanced in scientific and cosmological knowledge, we're actually not as enlightened as we believe. Not too long ago, humans thought the Earth was flat. And even some of Albert Einstein's ideas now seem outdated due to the strange world of quantum mechanics. This field suggests that something can exist in multiple places simultaneously, a concept that's hard to grasp. Today, we'll explore five of the weirdest cosmological theories that are sure to leave you scratching your head. Let's dive in. One of the most intriguing and controversial cosmological theories is the multiverse hypothesis. This idea suggests that multiple universes exist beyond what we can observe. Considering our own cosmos contains around 350 billion galaxies and spans about 94 billion light years, the notion that this could be just a tiny part of a much larger multiverse is mind-blowing. Surprisingly, this concept isn't new. It dates back to ancient Greek philosophers Leucippus and Democritus in the 5th century and has evolved over the centuries. The term multiverse was first used by American philosopher and psychologist William James in 1895, gradually becoming a part of cosmological discussions. Although there is no evidence to support the multiverse theory, some issues with current cosmological theories might give it credibility. For example, the Big Bang theory states that the universe began with a massive explosion about 13.8 billion years ago and has been expanding ever since. One aspect of the multiverse theory posits that our Big Bang was one of many, each creating its own universe. Another idea is that the Big Bang produced many bubbles, each evolving independently with its own physical laws. Proponents argue this could explain the fine-tuning of physical constants, making life possible. If infinite universes exist, there must also be an infinite number of atomic and particle combinations, most of which can't support life, but a few can. Next question is, could we be living in a computer simulation? This idea might sound outlandish, but the simulation theory suggests that our reality, including the entire universe, is just a computer simulation created by an advanced civilization or higher beings. While it may seem like a conspiracy theory straight out of the matrix, it gained credibility from a 2003 paper by Oxford professor Nick Bostrom titled, Are You Living in a Computer Simulation? Although it sounds preposterous, several leading scientists believe it's a theory worth considering. At the heart of simulation theory is the idea that an advanced civilization has the capability to create simulations so detailed and lifelike that the simulated beings would believe they live in a real, physical universe. The rapid advancement of virtual reality and computer simulations in our society supports this notion. While current games like The Sims and Minecraft are far from this level, it's logical to think that someday, computer characters could become so advanced they can think and act independently, just like humans. The theory can get quite fantastical. Are we a simulation created by a master race that lived on Earth millions of years ago but evolved beyond our understanding? Are we participants in a game created by a single omnipotent player? Could this player be what some people think of as God? Theoretical physicist David Bohm once said, Reality is what we take to be true. What we take to be true is what we believe. What we believe is based upon our perceptions. What we perceive depends on what we look for. What we look for depends on what we think. What we think depends on what we perceive. What we perceive depends on what we believe. What we believe determines what we take to be true. What we take to be true is our reality. And if you thought black holes were confusing, welcome to the even more perplexing world of white holes, where everything works in reverse. A black hole forms when a massive star exhausts its nuclear fuel and collapses under its gravity, creating an area with such intense gravitational pull that nothing can escape. Surrounding this is the event horizon, beyond which nothing can return. 
One theory suggests black holes act as wormholes linking different worlds or universes, possibly even serving as a multiverse superhighway. If that's the case, there must be an exit to the wormhole, which is where white holes come in. White holes are essentially black holes in reverse, expelling everything rather than consuming. While no direct evidence of white holes exists, they captivate scientists, science fiction writers, and internet enthusiasts. This idea is theoretical, but was predicted by Einstein's theory of gravity, although his concept of a singularity within a black hole might contradict it. Are white holes the key to time travel, or parts of the intricate fabric of space-time? One final thought. What if the Big Bang was the result of a white hole, with everything in our universe coming from another place or time? The Big Bang theory leaves us with the question of what existed before this colossal eruption that created the universe. The Egg Periodic Theory, also known as the Big Splat Theory, suggests our universe was formed through the collision of two higher dimensional worlds, or brains, themselves part of a much greater reality that we can only dream of understanding. Brain theory, a part of string theory, suggests we live within higher dimensional membranes floating through space or the larger multiverse. Humans experience reality through four dimensions, three spatial and one temporal, but string theory posits up to ten dimensions. Our universe could be a single membrane layer within a larger stack, each with its own reality and laws. The Big Splat Theory proposes that a universe is created when two of these membranes collide, converting kinetic energy into matter and energy, sparking life. This intense collision pushes the membranes apart, but eventually they slow down and begin moving toward each other again, leading to another Big Bang and the creation of new, radically different universes. Every few years, excitement builds among those scanning the skies for extraterrestrial life, only to be dampened by warnings not to get our hopes up. Since the late 1950s, humans have used radio telescopes to search the universe, but so far, nothing concrete has been found. However, there have been some notable unexplained signals. In 1977, astronomer Jerry Amon, using Ohio State University's Big Ear Radio Telescope, discovered an intense signal from the Chi Sagittari star system, dubbed the WOW signal. It lasted 72 seconds and was never heard again, but it sparked renewed interest in the search for extraterrestrial intelligence recent projects, such as Breakthrough Listen, have recorded promising signals from stars like Proxima Centauri and YZ Ceti. One common explanation for such signals is pulsars, highly dense, rapidly rotating neutron stars emitting electromagnetic radiation. An outlandish theory suggests an advanced civilization could manipulate pulsars to send messages or use their waves as intergalactic highways. A 2014 paper proposed that radio waves from pulsars could be encoded with information, or that a structure around a pulsar could place messages in the emitting waves. This may seem far-fetched, but after today's theories, it doesn't seem quite so outlandish. Thanks for joining us on this mind-bending journey through some of the strangest cosmological theories out there. If you enjoyed this deep dive into the weird and wonderful world of cosmology, don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe to our channel, and ring the bell for notifications so you never miss an update. Leave us a comment below with your thoughts on these theories, and which one blew your mind the most.